Hello guys, this is going to be a quick message from the Divine Masculines to the Divine Feminines of what they want you to know right now in this moment of this reading. And as you can see, I'm using the Divine Masculine Dark Truths from Beautiful Liz from Guided by Angels. So what is it, the Divine Masculines, what's their deepest, darkest truths? What is it they want you to know right now in this moment of this reading from their true self? Nice clear message please, Divine Masculines to the Divine Feminine. I care. I'm sorry for ignoring you and making you doubt how I feel. It was selfish of me. I care about you and I always will. So they do care. I hurt. Sometimes when I think of you, it hits me so hard just how badly I've messed it all up. Will you ever forgive me? And let's go here to see what else wants to come out. I'm understanding. I'm facing my truth and going within to become a better person. I know I have a purpose here and I want to be able to work on that. So your divine masculine does care and they're very sorry that they've ignored you and it's brought and created so much fear and doubt within you. They understand and realise how selfish it was to do that to you. They didn't mean to hurt you and they didn't mean to bring up any doubt within you. They don't want you to question it. They don't want you to feel as if you've got it wrong. They want you to know that they do care. They do love you. And they will always care and love you. And it does hurt them so much. How they have messed things up. How they have pushed you away. And they worry about, you know, have I messed things up so bad that you're not going to forgive me? But they are very aware and they are awake to have this understanding. You know, they really are facing their truths. Facing what has happened. Facing how they've behaved. Understanding why they behave that way. And they know that they do have a purpose, they do have a mission to be truthful to themselves, to be themselves. And they're working on that, they're working with that at the moment. They are going so deep within. And it is hard for you, Divine Feminines, to understand that. At times, to understand why your Divine Masculine behaves the way they do. But they are just reflecting back to you what is going on within you. And by them ignoring you brought the doubt and the fear up in you, which had to be dealt with. Which is pushing you to trust your intuition, to have this relationship with yourself, to clear any doubts, no matter what. And that is what you're doing. And this is why your divine masculine is taking responsibility and owning up to things that have gone wrong in the past, that, you know, the way they've behaved. And being honest with themselves, you know, that it is fear that's stopping them. It is fear that stops them sharing how they truly feel towards you. Don't be offended or don't take it personally about your divine masculine ignoring you or if there is silence. Because whatever you're feeling by that behaviour, by that experience from your divine masculine is helping you grow and pushing you to trust yourself once and for all. And you're releasing the doubt and the fear by nothing happening. And these messages of communication from your divine masculine is so positive because <laughs> it's showing they are so awake, so aware, and really doing the work that needs to be done by facing the truth, facing what they were so fearful of. You're both doing the same. <laughs> Even though it comes in different ways, it's, you know, you experience it from your divine masculine rejecting you. 
by your divine masculine rejecting you, they're rejecting themselves so they hurt and they're going through just the same thing as you. Both of you are going through the same thing. So I hope this helps you and this gives you some understanding of what's going on with your divine masculine. And you are in that place of truth where you can actually feel and know that your divine masculine cares. I hope you have an amazing, blessed evening, day, wherever you are in the world, whatever time it is. And I'm sending you so much love, my support, my strength and light, and I love you all so very much. See ya. Oh, what's your soul saying? Oh.